welcome back to my channel i know it's been a, a long minute it's been a good it's been a good while uh, most of you already know that um my daughter was in surgery a lot of you said well wishes and prayers and i appreciate that i appreciate each and every single one of you thank you for those um nice comments that you left my daughter is feeling better she is recovering nicely slowly but nicely she's still in pain but it's to the point um where she's able to walk without anyone helping her to walk she's able to walk on her own and she moves slowly but she's getting there but we were out of groceries <clears throat> we really haven't been doing any grocery shopping um we've just been using whatever we had and mixing it even if it was just a soup for a day it was just it's just been a long month but we needed to stock up on groceries and waters so we did that excuse me were, was she dragging you yeah. <laughs> she was dragging her um so this should hold me off for about another month maybe three and a half weeks maybe three weeks um there wasn't any chicken at costco so i'm gonna have to go back during the week to pick up just chicken because the only chicken that i found was frozen chicken and i'd rather have fresh chicken um but it is what it is i just got a little pack to hold me off till then um but other than that this was about 850 dollars um yeah and i also have a menu for three weeks that i had to put up so let's get started this is for the for those of you that are new thank you so much for joining i saw there i actually went on line and i saw that i gained some new subscribers thank you guys so much for subscribing and joining um and being a part of my journey with my kids and myself um this is basically what i do grocery hauls vlogs here and there cook with me videos and so on so for those of you that are new when i go grocery shopping i stop at three stores only because Costco and Sam's Club does not carry little stuff that I need, which is like cilantro, um, on uh, not onions, jalapenos, little stuff like that, green onions that I use on my normal dishes. So I needed, is my flesh on? It is on. So I needed to get that, um, I needed to get those things. So this is all Walmart, Sam's Club, and Costco mixed together. This is about $850. Let's go do this um, menu board for the three weeks and then we'll get into this haul. So today would be, this is what we had yesterday. It was just ground beef with some conchas, um, fideo mixed all together in a soup. It was really good. Today is Monday, so dad cooks dinner. My husband's gonna make whatever he wants and whatever he decides to make, that's what we'll have. So he's cooking dinner. Tuesday, we'll have some ceviche. Wednesday, spicy linguine, which is just a, a spicy pasta. Thursday would be a shrimp ziti. Just notice these are two back-to-back -back pastas. I might switch with another one, I'm not sure. Um, shrimp ziti, Alfredo shrimp ziti, pot rolls for Friday, and then Saturdays is sandwiches, chicken, bacon wraps, ribs, chicken mole, pork chops, chicken and waffles, carne asada, beef tacos. So keep in mind, like for example, chicken and mole. I am gonna make the chicken mole with rice and beans, pork chops, probably mashed potatoes and macaroni and cheese. So these are just like the main entree. And then I do make the sides. Then for Sunday the 24th, we'll have stir fry, barbecue pulled pork, um, carne with tomate cebolla chile, which is just ground beef mixed with onions and tomato and chili. If you guys watch my husband's lunch videos, then you know what type of carne that I'm talking about because he really likes this. Then we have stuffed chicken breast, hot dogs, hot dogs, and popcorn chicken. So this is just like the main dish and popcorn chicken, mashed potatoes, maybe some french fries instead of potatoes hot dogs with some chips and so on. So this is what the month of January is looking. Well, up until the 29th and then I'll go ahead and redo it. Um, for those of you that are new, the way that we do here at home 
there is seven of us here at home there's seven days in a week obviously so in order for everybody to get a dish that they like instead of saying why don't we never have this or this or this everybody picks what they want we throw it in the will decide and we let the will decide to see which day which person gets what so for example this was my choice i got it on sunday my daughter my husband my other little girl my older daughter my oldest daughter and my little girl i don't even know where my son's is on here oh he got pot roast but i don't think he got anything this week did you get ribs son what'd you pick Tacos or hot dogs? We got hot dogs here. Your fish tacos aren't on here. Uh-oh. We're going to have to add him, his, add his on here somehow. Yes, for fish tacos. I'll fix it in some way. But on the 27th, he has surgery for his wisdom teeth to get taken out. So he's probably not going to have hot dogs because he can't eat it. So I'm going to switch it with somebody else on this day. So I'm going to have to fix that up. But this is what the um, the three weeks of the month of menu is looking. I said that all wrong, but you got what I'm saying. So let's start right here. <clears throat> we always t um, get water bottles because we like to carry it on. We're like if we leave somewhere, we take a water bottle instead of buying them sodas or whatever the case is. These two were delivered from Walmart. Then we got three from Sam's Club and three from Costco. We have some potatoes here. These are from Costco. I prefer the ones from Sam's Club, but I forgot to get them at Sam's Club, so I ended up settling for the potatoes at Costco. Costco's potatoes always seem to be so dirty. Um, yeah, and they have this really strong potato smell to it, but it is what it is. We got some sparkling water. This is the black, let me see, black raspberry flavor, orange mango, and kiwi strawberry. So there are seven of us in the house. Only one person likes this, which is my youngest little girl. Not the smallest, but the second smallest. So these 24 bottles will last her a good month or so. So we picked up some of those. Now moving on. It's all mixed up. I don't know. I'm not going to be able to put the prices on. I still got to put all this away. And yeah, so we have great value garlic toast. This would be for the, one of the menus of which was baked Alfredo ziti. So we'll have some of that. I ordered two of the Hawaiian punches. They only sent one. These are from Walmart delivery. I'm gonna have to ask them to reimburse me my money. For chicken mole, these are the ones that I use. I bought four of these. These are about a dollar and uh, I'm gonna say seven cents a piece. So I bought four just to have here and whenever we feel like having mole my little girl asked for more glue which is the washable clear glue probably just gonna end up buying her a big old tub of elmer's glue because she's like yes because <laughs> buying little ones like this here and there it's yeah so we have two of the original tacos from taco bell seasoning this would be for our soft taco night that's on our menu a slow cooker of this pot roast um, seasoning mix for another menu and my husband's making steak for dinner today so we wanted some au jus sauce so we got some au jus gravy we have baby clams for our ceviche um, honey and then some of this let me see co coarse kosher salt these are from Walmart. All this right here. This would be from Sam's Club. We got some Cool Ranch Doritos, Walmart restaurant style tortilla chips, and some Sam's Club Hot Cheetos. I picked up four of the ZD boxes. These were 88 cents a piece. Um, we are a big family, so I have to make two. When I make pasta, I always use two boxes, whether it's spaghetti, bow tie, rigatoni, whichever type of pasta, whatever it is, I always have to use two. So I have two for one dinner and then another two for a backup dinner or even just a lunch with Parmesan cheese or some spinach or something like that quick for the kids while they are homeschooled. I have some tissue paper here for, um, my daughter makes 
strawberry what are they chocolate covered strawberries and she sells them so when she designed um she fixed up boxes she adds all kinds of stuff in it and i picked her up some tissue because she has an order for this weekend for a birthday order some tall kitchen drawstring bags recycle what i asked for recycling bags and they sent me regular kitchen bags i'm gonna have to go get recycling bags i needed the clear ones see i didn't need them so they sent me this one i bought this at sam's club these are on sale for 14 13.50 i think so i picked up one of these and i guess we'll have another one like this for backup but i'm gonna have to go to walmart and get the recycling bags i got actually the 500 count of great value napkins they replaced them with three of the 100 count for the same price but let me show you why i got these i was gifted one of these so it's a napkin holder i'm a sucker for butterflies so it just sits at the table it doesn't go here just i have everything on the table put the napkins there what is your problem you're being goofy okay so we have mr clean magic erasers these are on sale at costco for six dollars and some change i picked up one this is for four extra durable three kitchens and four bath um scrubbers these are okay they're not i mean it gets the job done let me get down here so that i'm not facing upwards okay clorox four colors i really like these for my husband's clothes well his more the kids are not so dirty because not saying my husband is but like he works outside and the sweat and stains from working and stuff like that so this is really good for his clothes um as for my kids as much i really don't use it for them because they just basically wear house clothes we don't go anywhere with this pandemic going on we're not allowed to do anything but stay home which is fine but i picked this up for my husband's work clothes which is it works pretty good Got some Colgate um, Bursting with Freshness Breath Stripped Breath Strips Toothpaste. So we got that. These were on sale, I think. Oh, no, they weren't on sale. They were just like $10. Disposable gloves. Um, my daughter makes... I'm going to stop saying them. My daughter makes heart chocolates. And she made one just to test out the color. And she left fingerprints everywhere. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy you some disposable kitchen gloves. But which is good because I hate touching raw meat with my hands because I always have to wash them. And I'll probably just end up using these two for raw meat and such not. These were a good price. There's one, two, three, four boxes of 500 count in each. I think it was like $8 or $9. Not too sure on the price. We got a thing of lemons, a bag of lemons. And I was finally able to get some basmati rice. I was having a hard time looking for it. So basmati rice is same as rice, regular rice, but a longer grain. So we got some of some of that. Aluminum trays. I have no um, glass trays here to make um, baked zitis or baked pastas or anything that has to go in the oven. Why was I holding it down there? But I really like these disposable ones. So I picked up. Uh, bag of that we got some folders 100 the 100 count in the medium roast classic roast can't forget the oranges we got a big box of oranges from costco some more ketchup ketchup is a necessity here at the house we have these hand soaps here i picked up three it was only one cent one limit per cent so i got one o ocean breeze milk and honey and pink grapefruit these are about two dollars a piece they're kind of expensive let me just start from right here and then we have stainless steel cleaner and polish for the refrigerators microwave stoves and handles or and dishwasher or whatever the case is we have some of that the sink the boys needed some shaving gel we got a pack of that we have some salted sweet cream butter asparagus 
some celery for pot roast. A thing of lettuce. And I picked up two bags of avocados. These were $3.98 for, I think, five of them come in there. Let me see. Two, four, oh, six come in there. $3.98 at Costco for six avocados. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave them out, let them get ripe, and then I'm going to freeze what I don't use. Did you guys know you guys can freeze a whole avocado? Well, you guys can. So these are super hard. I'm going to leave them out for a couple of days. So once they get ripe, I'm going to leave what I need out and then freeze the other avocados. And then just let it sit for a couple of hours and then they'll be good to eat. So if you didn't know, you can freeze avocados like this whole, you can. We got some grapes. They're looking a little funky but we needed to buy some look at this they look no bueno they look they don't look that good honestly um english muffins for breakfast for husband in the mornings tomatoes we use a lot of tomatoes here at home i picked up this greek pita bread flat bread um it's really soft i don't know for lunch or Maybe on that wrap night, I could use this instead of regular wraps. When is that? That's a week from now. I wonder if I could freeze this. Has anybody freeze this? So I got some of that. Provolone cheese. They, I ordered the 24 count. They didn't have it. They switched it for two two packs of the 12 slice count, which is 24. Pepper Jack sliced cheese. That's 12 slices in there. We have some wraps here from Sam's Club. And then we have some of these tortillas, the uncooked tortillas. So you just cook them on a comal and they're good to go. We have some cilantro. I wanted um, some serranos and jalapenos. They sent two pounds of jalapenos. Mm -hmm. I like serranos better than jalapenos, but they didn't have any. So they gave me double the amount of jalapenos. Mushrooms for steak dinner tonight. I like my steak smothered in onions and mushrooms. So we got some mushrooms. Little tiny baby cucumbers. Carrots. Miracle Whip. Let me see. Velveeta cheese. Got this hand cream. Well, not hand cream, just any type of moisturizing cream. It's CeraVe, Cera, Cera I don't know how you would say it. This was for $14. My skin and my kid's skin gets really dry during the winter. So I'm going to see how this works. I tried that Cetaphil one. It really didn't do much. But I picked this one up and hopefully it does something. Because we be dry. Got some Miracle Whip. Um, some limes. Some spinach there. I'll work my way around that side right now. Did I say bananas? I don't know. Bananas. Two green, two bunches of green onions. Two packs of the Caesar salad kicks. This is the cheese and garlic croutons with shredded Parmesan cheese. So I got two bags of that. Um, just regular lettuce. Well, not regular lettuce. The romaine lettuce heads. There's five in there. Some blueberries. We got this Hillshire Farm. The two pounds of turkey breast and honey ham. I'm guessing a pound each. Yeah, they're in there. Hot dogs for what's... Let me see. Yeah, it's on the menu. I have um, another eight count here. So that I just needed one. So I just picked one up. The seafood and shrimp salad. My husband likes that. I got some of that for him. Some bacon, this was $12.99 for four of them. Yeah. So we got some Costco bacon and the Costco bacon that's already cooked. So these ones I use for beans, um, spicy linguine. What else? I hadn't even think right now at the top of my head. But these I have here ready made for sandwiches, wraps, or just a quick breakfast with some scrambled eggs or something like that. So I got that. Whatever I don't use from here, I'll freeze. Hot link sandwich. Hot link, hot link sausages for my husband and my daughter. They like those. I'm not a fan of those, but they like them. We have some crab meat. This is for the ceviche. That is for ugh, tomorrow. I gotta make that. 
You're helping me, right, buddy? Yeah. Yeah. It was your pick on the menu. <laughs> so we have some crab meat. I just got the big old bunch that they have there at Sam's Club. I don't use it all, so I'll probably use half of it. The other half, my daughter likes to snack on it just like that. So she could have the, the rest that she wants. Not all in one sitting, but in little in portions. Kirk, um, Kirkland. Costco was out of chicken. They had no rotisserie chicken. They had no fresh chicken. They had no type of chicken, but frozen chicken like this. So I picked up one bag of the chicken breast. This would be the first time that I try chicken breast like this. So... I picked one up at Walmart like this, and it was a great value brand. And it was a whole chicken breast, but when I cooked it, it was smaller than my hand. So I was like, what the hell? I I told my husband I'll never buy frozen chicken like that again. But I bought frozen chicken like that. This is a Kirkland brand. Hopefully it's good. I like that they're individually wrapped. Um, and hopefully these don't shrink up as much. So we're gonna try that out, see how it is. Three bags of shrimp. This is the three pound raw easy pill shrimp. Wait, this chicken was like 20 something dollars. The shrimp was 15.99. I'm sorry, I ate a, I just ate a carnitas burrito on the movie here. So I um, picked up three of these, four ceviche, for shrimp ziti, and I don't know what else is on there. Oh, for stir fry. And just to have some for my husband's lunches. I haven't been making them lunches lately and I feel bad. I need to start. Okay, so take out crispy wings. My daughter, we were at Costco and she texted me. Oh no, sounds good. She texted me. She's like, mom, bring some of these. She sends me a picture. I'm like, okay. So these are take out crispy wings. Classic Buffalo style. These were pricey. At Sam's Club, they're $18.99. And then we go to Costco and they have them for $16.99. So, Where did they get them from? you told me to get them at Costco, but we were at Sam's Club and I saw them there, so I was like, we'll just get them. But yeah, so we got her some of that. Um, she better like them. Hazelnut creamer is the best creamer. Parmesan cheese to have when I opened the last one that we had, uh, how many days ago? A couple of days ago. So I like to replace it since Parmesan cheese we use for everything, even if it's, um, sopitas or what do we put cheese on spaghetti ravioli stuff like that just anything they put parmesan cheese on anything just like ketchup so i just opened the other one so i wanted to replace that other backup one in the storage in the pantry so we have that one here i got some mexican style blend cheese this is the two pack we have some state fair corn dogs for lunch for the kids and some chimichangas lunch for as well for the kids or Sometimes I'd be making dinner a little bit early because I can't sleep. If I have dinner like around 7, 30 or, after, or like even at 6 o'clock, I start feeling like, ugh, I don't feel good. I can't eat late. So I always make dinner like around 4. I will start cooking probably like at 2, 3, or 4. That's when we'll have dinner. The latest we probably have dinner would be like 5. But sometimes when I make an early dinner, the kids stay they get hungry around 7.30, 8 o'clock. They start getting the munchies. So I get that. You know what? Go throw corn dog in the microwave and go eat. Same with the chimichanga. Same with the macaroni and cheese. I picked up a seven and a half dozens of eggs. So we have that there. I think we only had like four eggs left. I really needed to go to the grocery store. Okay, so you guys remember those the last Costco haul that I did? I picked up those noodles that had um como se llaman esas cosas the rice cakes the kids really like the rice cakes okay you know what my husband's on there on a company phone let me go let me go close the door that loco tu papa okay so the rice cakes it was really really good I, I like the rice cakes. They would eat the noodles. I'd eat the rice cakes. When I went back to get more, there was none. Those were only like $3 and some change. But this was new there. Well, I don't know if it's been there, but this is the first time that I saw it. This is a haka. I probably said that wrong. Haka, haka. Um, thick cut noodles. Spicy mala chili sauce packets. There's 12 packets in here, and it was about like 7 and some change. It looks really good. 
Um, I'm going to be real with you. I can't eat this. If I have to take a bite, I got to have antacids next to me because, yeah. But I like spicy foods. So I got that for them. Hopefully they like it. And if they like it, hopefully Costco has it in stock all the time because they wanted this other one the with the rice cakes. They didn't have them. So I brought that one. One thing of tissue from Costco. Sam's Club had no tissue at all. So it was I was only allowed to... I was only able to get one for for the month. I don't know. Maybe I'll go back and see if they have another one when I go back to find chicken. We have flushable wipes here for the booties. Okay. Angus beef patties. This is the 18 count patties here. This is all the meat stuff. It's all thrown in here. I got to separate everything. We have meat patties for hamburger night. It's not on the menu, but sometimes even though I have this menu, there'll be a day like, you know what? I don't really, for example, hot dogs. Ugh, I don't like hot dogs. See, <laughs> I don't know. It's just something about a hot dog that I don't like. And maybe when I have my husband grill the hot dogs, I'll tell him to throw a couple of hamburger patties on there so that whoever doesn't like hot dogs could have it. So I like to have that on hand. I got some pork longaniza. Uh, this was from Walmart. Um, this would be for the spicy linguine that we are having in a couple of days on Wednesday. So I picked that up there. Pork chops. These are pretty thick. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut them in half. Or like my husband says, butterfly cut them. And get two pieces out of each. These were $5.93. So I got that one. We got two of these pack, well, one two pack of the Italian ground sausage for spaghettis, pastas, or even breakfast. A thing of ribs. This is on the menu for next week. This was thirty seven ninety three. This is the pork ribs. So I think three come in there. Yeah. Can you see one, two, three? There's three in there. My husband's gonna have to dismembering them and all that because I am not. That is gross. He's going to tell me, but you bought the gloves. <laughs> Crab. Ground beef. This is $18.60. This is $88.12. Oh, yeah, it's right there. Mm. So I got some ground beef. I only got one because that whole menu, there's only one recipe that calls for ground beef. So I get one. I get three, three dinners out of this ground beef. So I'll have one for that menu and two for whatever... Like I said, if there's a day that I don't feel like making something off of that menu, then I'll just switch it to something else. I haven't been able to find Hamburger Helper. The kids really like Hamburger Helper. Yeah. Well, the other kids. She's really picky. <laughs> and um, I'm going to have to go on a hunt for some. So we got ground beef there. So pot roast is on the menu for next week. Oh, no, this week, Friday. So I picked up these two packs. Well, it's one pack, two packs. Um, chunks come in at this is twenty five eighty two, so two big old thick cuts of pot rolls. I got three things of chorizo, the beef chorizo. They like it with their beans, beans and chorizo, chorizo with eggs, chorizo with papas, chorizo with I don't know what else. That's probably all. Okay, where it ended. There it is. <laughs> on fell. Okay, and then the last thing down here is it's for dinner tonight, which would be the beef ribeye steak. That was fifty dollars and eighty four cents. Let me try to get it up. Hijos de madre. Okay, that was heavy. So when we buy steak, my husband buys them like this: the four packs, one. Not four packs, four slices, four chunks. One, two, three, four. He butterflies them and cuts them in half. So we get two pieces per steak. Two, four, six, eight. So there'll be six, eight pieces of steak. There's seven of us, which means there'll be one steak left there. For, up for grabs for whoever wants it. They could fight for it. <laughs> but I think that's it. I'm looking around to see if there's anything. Look at the chorizo. 
for chorizo stayed down there. I'm gonna have to get it. Well, obviously. Did I show you, did I show them the water? I showed them the water, huh? Okay. Yeah, I'm out of breath. No, I have to do the fun part and put everything away. You're not gonna help me? Hija de tu madre. No, you're gonna help me. I can't. Cause you love me. me. I'm gonna pay you with room and board. Okay. I guess. I guess. <laughs> so guys, this was eight hundred and fifty-one dollars and some change. Eight fifty-two, eight fifty, whatever you wanna say. Um, this should last me three weeks up to a month, and pretty much that's it. This is yeah, this is it. I am going to go back during the week, so you're going to see another grocery haul. Well, not a grocery grocery haul, but a chicken haul. <laughs> it's really, you guys are going to see a chicken haul in a couple of days, because i got to go back and get some regular chicken, because that menu is filled with chicken for the whole month, or the three weeks. But guys, I know I've been gone for a while. I know I have no backup videos. This is video that you guys are going to see today. I will have none. I'm going to try to get back to my routine, which is a video every other day. So I'm going to, you guys got to bear with me. It's going to take some time to come back a little bit slowly, but I am back for those of you that missed me. Yay! <laughs> I missed you guys as well. Um, so after this video that you guys will see today, I will try to have one. I will try to go back to my normal routine, which is a movie, a movie, a video every other day. So I'm going to do some, a couple of things. I do need to go out. Maybe I'll do a vlog with the kids. I have doctor's appointments coming up and stuff like that. But your sister has one on the 13th. Jazzy has one on the 20th. And Nochito has one on the 27th. I'm a busy woman. Now the fun part. Putting all this beautifulness away. <sighs> Any takers? I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Guys, I appreciate each and every single one of you. Like I said in the beginning, thank you much for your, for your beautiful comments, your friendship, your prayers, your love, and everything. I appreciate you guys so much. You guys are awesome. You guys are my best friends. You guys are my buds. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today. And I will see you guys on the next one. If you guys are new, please consider subscribing and joining and being a part of the family. I do have an Instagram account that it is linked in my about me section. I will try to get that back up. I think the last picture I posted was a couple weeks ago. Like I said, everything has happened so fast that I started. It just, well, you guys already know I'm not going to get back into that. But you guys, I will see you guys in the next video. You guys stay safe and stay warm. And I will see you guys in a couple of days. Bye.